and we know that students can't learn without having a strong sense of belonging. The state superintendent's latest address pinpoints issues schools across Washington have faced even before the pandemic. Staff at Central Valley School District say while some of their priorities are in line with what the state superintendent shared, they're working on others to cater to their students' needs. Our Bronte Sarotsky shares how the district is working to improve attendance, learning, and mental health for their students. Across Washington, students are still struggling when it comes to their mental health needs. In addition to that, schools in eastern Washington, like the Central Valley School District, say they have their work cut out for them when it comes to enrollment. We found that some parents felt it was important to take their students out of public schools and enroll them in private schools. And now, the district is working to implement new programs and initiatives for students to feel safe and secure in the classroom. Be that attractive piece that brings our families that are interested in public schools back to our schools. Instead of focusing as much on maybe some loss of um, student growth, we this year are working on implementing new math curriculum. Another key initiative the district is working on, improving their students' mental health. We know that students can't learn without having a strong sense of belonging. The district is now partnering with two mental health agencies to work alongside school counselors and administrators. For students that may be on a um, higher need for some of those uh, mental health clinicians support and um, are continually working with students and families to engage them and um, help them with uh, again, the sense of belonging. And parents are the lifeline for students. The district says they want to work directly with parents to understand where their child's needs are and aren't being met. Reporting in Spokane Valley, Bronte Sorotsky, 4 News Now.